Hello everyone, in this tutorial we will learn how to hide the sailing when the top pound is active and show it back if the walking mode is active. Some people have comment and ask for this and I hope this will help you. Let's open our project. Select the floor then we want to duplicate it to use as a sailing. Change the collision preset to no collision so it won't block any pound. Let's make the sailing a little thinner by adjusting the Z value to 0.1. Also adjust the width and the length. This is just a representation of our sailing. If you are a Max user, we can use the attach modifier to combine the sailing with the light objects into a single mesh. Let's do a quick test. If we press tab, we want to hide the sailing component by clicking the material selector button. And if we click the POI icon, it will activate our work pound and the sailing will become visible. Now we want to convert this sailing object into a blueprint. Before we do that, we will check some details properties. Change the mobility to static. This way we can build the light. The sailing model is selected. Open this button. Select convert selection to blueprint class. Select harvest component and make sure static mesh actor is selected. Next, open the path location and we will save this blueprint under configurator folder under blueprint. And let's create a new folder called sailing. And press OK. Let's name this blueprint BP underscore sailing and press select. The blueprint will look like this. We are currently using engine content, that's why the sailing will look like box. Now let's open even grab. I will do a quick test to check if we can hide the sailing. From the even begin play node, drag and look for set visibility under rendering category. And make sure propagate to children is active. Drag and drop the static mesh component one into a canvas. And connect to target. And on the detail panel, and on the detail panel, let's double check the collision preset. And mobility set to static. This way we can build the light later. Let's do a quick test. If we press the simulate button, our selling will disappear. And this working as expected. Go back to BP sailing. Disable the wire and pressing shift plus left clicking on the wire. Next, let's add custom event. Change the name to hide selling And connect it to visibility node. Next, duplicate the current node system and paste it at the bottom area. Change the name to show sailing. Because it is showing sailing, 
make sure they enable new visibility. Press compile and save it. Now if we press the painting button, the sailing will now visible. We know that this is happened inside widget blueprint for the work mode. Open content folder, configurator folder, blueprint widget folder. Open the BP main widget. To show the button, select the fade in animation and move the slider to the right. Select the painting button. Scroll down from the detail panel and look for on click event. From the sequence node, add new pin. Let's duplicate this get all actor of class node. Connect the wire. For the actor class, we need to target the BP sailing. And from there, we will fire the height sailing event. From out of actor, drag and look for for each loop. From the array element, look for height sailing. And connect all inputs. Compile it and do quick test. Now the sailing is not visible as expected. Next, we want to show the sailing if we click on the POI icon. We know that we need to adjust it from POI button. Go back to the content folder and open POI folder. Open the POI widget one. Select the button and open the click event from the detail panels. Add a new pin. Let's copy the node system we created from BP mine widget. Paste it at the bottom. Connect the input and press compile. We will call this event later. From array element, look for show shelling and connect the loop body input. Press compile and let's do a quick test. As we can see, if we click on the POI icon, the shelling will show very quickly as expected. And we want it to show after our pound is already on the floor. To fix this, open BP shelling. From show shelling event, we will add delay node with duration of 0.5. Next, we want to hide the shelling again if we press tab key from POI pound. Let's open POI pound blueprint. From the sequence, add a new pin. Next, open the BP main widget and copy the node system again. Let's move it a bit to the top and pass to the node and connect the input. Press compile and let's do a quick test. All now is working as expected.